I believe we've become so disconnected with our position in the planet and with the ocean itself that we don't see ourselves as one. There's really an opportunity to do something different. The opportunity to actually clear up and, and make nice where we live is really important. We're always going to be fighting the battle, but the mission is to try and leave a planet that's suitable for our children. I'm Chris Desai, I'm the founder of the UOcean Project. The UOcean Project is a mission to clean, protect and restore the world's oceans by 2050. Our first mission is to remove a billion kilos of ocean plastics. Just seeing all the plastic consistently on every single port, every single beach. We've actually got a plastic crisis even in the waters in the UK. People think that it's not as bad as it is. And I think the shocking part is that even though we know it's bad, our behaviours and actions don't change to reflect that. I think, I think a lot of it potentially is um, self-induced barriers, perception, internal perception. So how specific communities um, perceive these types of activities. And I think if we can say, well, actually, this type of activity is open to everyone, then you know, we, can, we can do something together. Growing up in the UK, I was never really interested in conservation. However, I don't think it's something that black people are doing a lot of. I think it's something there's, there is a disconnect there for some reason. And I think there's really an opportunity to do something different. In conservation as a whole, there is a, a massive lack in Asian people, but not just Asian people, Asian women as well. We're always going to be fighting the battle, but the mission is to try and leave a planet that's suitable for our children, and hopefully they'll take on the responsibility of trying to rid the oceans of more plastic, because it's a never-ending, thankless job. So it's about educating you know, the younger generation how to live more sustainably, how to just not think it's acceptable to have single-use plastic. I don't want to be one of the people that just sits back and and think someone else will fix it. The cleanups are, I think, the biggest part of the Ocean project currently. It's the funnest part, it's the liveliest part. So we kind of go out there, we pick the plastic up, we have some music on, we make it fun. One billion kilos would be ultimately only 1% of the world's ocean plastics by 2030. It makes me really sad, but at the same time, what we want is ordinary people to just do a small action each. We would solve the plastic crisis. This is the one thing that unites us as a people, the planet, right? And we now have an opportunity to do something different. So let's do that. Mm -hmm. 